Now, can you believe that Thanksgiving is a little more than two weeks away? Mm. Where did the time go? As you prepare for the big holiday, maybe you're feasting at home this year. Well, don't forget about the wine. Yes, that explains what all of this just magically we appeared. We didn't want oh. you to forget. So poof, <laughs> the uh, president of Domain Serene Winery in Dayton, Ryan Harris, is with us live this morning to talk about some of their holiday pairing suggestions. Good morning, Ryan. Good morning, Jenny. Emily, how are you both? Oh, we're doing well. well. Now, better now that we're surrounded by all of your fabulous Always. wine. So, <laughs> you know, instead of a, taking a, a one wine fits all approach, you, you have a, a diverse holiday wine list for us. We do. In fact, um, a lot of people don't realize, but many Oregon wines uh, are absolutely perfect for holiday pairing, especially with Thanksgiving. So this is a time of year that, that we get pretty excited uh, to start popping some wines and thinking about what we're gonna cook for Thanksgiving. Uh, Pinot Noir is absolutely unnatural with turkey. Um, Chardonnay is, is, is spectacular with pretty much everything in, on your Thanksgiving table. Um, and even Rosé, uh, especially the Domaine Serene R Rosé, pairs beautifully with that tricky uh, pairing cranberry sauce. Oh. So, um, yeah, so we really have a nice array of wines and even getting into big red meats with, with Grand Cheval and some of the bigger, more robust reds that we make. So uh, nice. be sure about Oregon wines uh, this Thanksgiving. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. I know I, I usually try to always have like a, a red and a white out mm -hmm. so that people have something they like, but I, I don't know that I've always thought too specifically about the pairings. So I know you, you yeah. recommend um, your Evenstad Reserve Chardonnay for a really nice turkey pairing. Yeah, Evenstad Reserve Chardonnay is actually um, a few years ago was the world's top rated wine by Wine Spectator. And um, I will tell you, it's amazing on its own, but it's even better with uh, some incredible turkey. Uh, but I will say that one thing I love to do as well, is, it's really, you know, you've got a, almost a day full of cooking. And one of the traditions of my family is we start popping corks early and doing a little sip of each of the wines as we're cooking. And that's going to give you an idea of what pairs really well with that dish. Of course, it's a lot of fun to cook that way as well. Uh, and then you can have the rest of those wines once you're serving your, your dinner with the rest of your guests. I, I am Definitely. digging your family's tradition. Uh -huh. that, that sounds like a good one to start <laughs> at, at our house. And I don't even cook. I'll just go in and, and start doing you that. You could do yes. the wine sampler. Yeah. Yes. Okay. So I love uh, white Pinot Noir. And you guys have a really good one. And, and you're pairing it with salmon, baked salmon. Do, do a lot of people have that on Thanksgiving? Um, you know, it's, it's, it's relatively unique. Uh, we were the first to ever make it in Oregon, um, starting back in 2004, and Cor Blanc is the name of our white Pinot. Um, it's one of those wines that's really universal for pairing with lots of different things. So it makes you seem like a really uh, smart host. And, and also, a lot of people haven't had white Pinot Noir. So it's, it's kind of fun when your guests arrive to pour them a little splash and then ask them what they think it is. And people will think it's all kinds of different white wines, but rarely does anyone guess that it's actually a Pinot Noir. Yeah, um, it is a brain bender, that's for sure. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so um, we also have a really fun program. I, I think we'd all agree, you know, this year it's more important than ever uh, really to, to send the gift of connection to people. Um, a lot of us uh, love to spend time with each other in each other's homes, but it's going to be more challenging than ever this year. So we have kind of a fun campaign that we wanted to mention um, called Raise a Glass and Give a Glass. And what we encourage people to do is to buy a set of three or four wines and then set the same ones to their friends and family that they would normally uh, be entertaining with. And that way they can also be cooking the same recipes and then go on Zoom like we're doing now or pick up the phone and, and you can really have a fun opportunity to chat about the wines and also the food pairings that you made with them. And it's the next best thing to being there in person. Uh, if we can't travel, it's, it's what I'm planning to do this, this holiday season. So. Yeah, that's a fun idea. I know mm -hmm. wine is often my, my go-to gift for people just because you want to get something that you know they're going to they're gonna use and appreciate and enjoy. And uh, yeah, can't go wrong with that. So the uh, the gifting suggestion, I, I love that idea. Now, uh, just real quick, if we if we had to choose like two or three types of wine that would just be well-rounded for the Thanksgiving dinner, uh, give us the, the, the holiday shopping checklist. I know you mentioned uh, Chardonnay, Pinot Noir, always really good staples. Would those be your top picks? I would, I would start with rosé, mm -hmm. and a lot of people think rosé is for summer, but it's become a year-round wine. Um, pairs with almost everything. Then move on to Chardonnay, and then open that uh, that Evenstad Reserve Pinot Noir. It's, okay. uh, it's going to be a really awesome lineup, and it's beautiful on the table. You've got pink and golden and, and red, so it, it looks gorgeous. They're world-class wines, top award winners, and, um, and they're really going to be very friendly with anything you're serving.
I mean, I've always thought rosé all day. Rosé all, all day. Yes. So it makes I like your style. It's great Thanksgiving. Mm -hmm. Well, Ryan, thank you so much for joining us and, and uh, giving us, you know, some ideas for pairings. I, for I feel the more holiday. prepared now, yes. Do you feel more prepared? Uh -huh. Yeah. Okay. Well, to check out Domaine Serene's a full selection of wines, of course, we'll have a link to their online store on coin.com. Ryan, have a good one. Cheers. Thank you so much. Happy Thanksgiving. Happy holidays. Yeah, Happy you Thanksgiving too. to you, too.